make air fried french fries. First step, which I've already done, you want to cut, you want to peel them and cut them up into your desired shapes. I did them like this. And then once you're done with that, you're going to want to drip some water for about an hour and a half to two hours, but minimum is an hour. And then after that, you're going to want to drain the water and then get the potatoes and just dry them so that all the moisture is out. I'm drying them, they're going to put them on a plate like this and get about a bunch of oil and just dump it on and then like mix it up. You can do a bit of salt and pepper too if you want. Salt, bit of pepper, and you're gonna want to like mix it up. You're done mixing them up, and they're all oily. Just toss them in the air fryer, and shake them around. until crispy. For cooking, it's always good to have a dipping sauce, so we'll be making fry sauce, we're gonna need mayo, ketchup, and anything else that you'd want to put into it. This all I know is this is good, so maybe don't put anything else into it, but yeah. And then just go until it has like a nice like white tannish color. This is called fry sauce, so if you're not from Utah, you're if you don't, you need to try it if you're not from Utah. Alright, just a little bit of ketchup. Perfect, it should be looking like this. That's when you know it's done. Now that they're done, you can try them. And it's safe to say they're very good, so try them. And also, which one is the best? So let's find out. Two videos in one. So, let's go. Uh, lottery seasoning salt. Decent. Not bad. It's kind of like Cajun seasoning. And like the ramen video... The, we're going to do the three Trader Joe's. Everything but the bagel. Mm. So surprise me. That was good. Everything but the leftovers. And for the winner of the ramen video, chili lime. It's safe to say salt and pepper probably wins. But out of these four, definitely Lawry's. So, only use Lawry's unless you for some reason like the other crap.